Hey everybody. Hey. I'm just checking in. Um, I've been really quiet today. Today's been a busy day at work along with yesterday as well because I had Monday off. So like the whole week has just been blah, crazy. Um, but I just want to check in and let you guys know how I was doing. Um, went to the gym this morning. You guys saw that did not have a very good go of it like it was one of those times where i was just like i don't want to be here why am i still here like get me off of this stair climber just not even not T tiffany will tell you like i was not feeling it like the whole time i was not my normal rah, bc self you know like usually i'm in the gym and i want to kill it and today i did just did not have the urge to do that um so I got like a 35 minute workout and or something something light I came back home and uh, had breakfast and laid back down and it was just so hard to get out of bed my muscles are extremely sore like so sore I've been pushing you know harder upping my weights and stuff like that and my ass, like my glutes and my quads are just like, help me. Why did you do that to us? Um, I do know there's no pain, no gain, and da 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 da, -da. But um, I'm taking a break from the gym this afternoon. I like really feel like my body's telling me to rest. Um, and I'm changing my schedule up a little bit. I was going every morning to the gym and then doing more two-a-day workouts. Um, and I'm just finding that to be a little bit unnecessary. Uh, it's, I, I feel like it might be impeding my progress because I am getting little less than I need to amount of sleep. Um, and it's stressing me out a little bit. You know what I mean? Like I'm not getting good sleep. So therefore I'm tired all day long and you know, my body and my mind can't function properly that way. And it's a little bit stressful. So, um, what I decided was to only do Monday, uh, to do morning workouts Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, and have those be an option of two a day. And then work out every afternoon, Monday through Friday. Take, um, let myself have either Saturday or Sunday rest. Um, I think that's going to be a lot better for me. That's what I was doing before. And um, that that seemed that seemed to work a little bit better for me for my schedule and for my mental and physical health and all that stuff. Um, so making changes when they're necessary. Boom, that's done. Now to go on to the food for today because I wasn't that good today. <laughs> I really wasn't that great today. Um, it wasn't anything extraordinarily bad, um, but like probably because I have been working out so much more that you know I need a little bit more calorie intake but I know that there's better ways of doing it than eating 300 calorie 380 calories worth of cheese I did that today um, I've done worse to myself in the past I've eaten over a thousand calories of cheese brie Woo, girl bye I will eat a whole thing of brie I gotta stay away from cheese me and cheese cheese is one of my addiction foods like um if i would have had 800 calories of cheese at my disposable I, disposal i probably would have eaten 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 that's not a word i probably would have eaten um all of it uh and while i was eating it i wasn't even enjoying it really i was like oh i know i'm gonna feel like like shitty about this later and i'm gonna be constipated and who wants that and you know just i knew better I knew better and I don't want to find an excuse for it on why I did it necessarily um, I do try to find the reasons behind my actions and um, not having a clear head you know and being exhausted does help make you help you make not the best decisions it's like if you were drunk you're not gonna make the best decisions when you're sleep drunk you're not making the best decisions for your life it's very um instant gratification self-gratification 
and um, that's really not the way to, to live and do that. And the reason I'm sharing this with you guys is because we have to be honest um, when it comes to our weight loss or just whatever, just to be accountable for your actions. Um, you know, I used to say, I don't know why I'm so big. I really don't eat that much. And I've heard that before, you know. I don't know why I'm not losing weight. I really don't eat that much. and Or my diet's not bad. Or I work out, kind of. You know what I mean? Um, we can't make changes to what we don't acknowledge. It's like an addict going to AA and refusing to do the first step, which is admitting you have a problem. I know I have a problem with food. I will always have a problem with food just the same way an alcoholic's always an alcoholic. I'm always going to have an issue with food. I'm always going to have to be conscious of that issue and make decisions based on that issue with food. And I get funny like this past weekend, people looking at me crazy because of the decisions that I made with my food and stuff and no thank you, I want to pass up the cheese and meat tray because I can't fucking handle myself around cheese. Like I just really fucking can't. Like there's something about cheese and cheese that like just satisfies that, that need or whatever. Whatever that is that's inside me that burns so hard for cheese, like <laughs> I don't know. But um, like cheese is like my heroin and I just can't really have it in the house unless it's for sandwiches or something and even then it's like ah oh, fuck I gotta forget that it's in the refrigerator um I I, I want to share this with you guys because like I can't always just be like woohoo I had a great day I had a great day I had a great day because not every day is great um and that's not honest you guys like are really important to me and I'm not gonna lie or speak myths mistruth to people who are important to me I love you guys and with love comes honesty, truth, and respect. And um, I respect you too much to be fudging the truth. Like, the same person I am in real life is the same person that you see right now. Like, I'm in my underwear. <laughs> On my bedroom floor because my phone is about to die. Um, just hanging out. And that's me. And I love you guys. And I love you for supporting me and appreciating me. Even on days where I ate 380 calories worth of cheese. All right, um, I'll check in with you guys later. I have some stuff that I'm working on, bloggy stuff. Um, I don't have a computer, so it does, it's a little bit tax, taxing to um, to blog all of my stuff. That's why I've been vlogging and blogging at the same time. So just bear with me. Um, I love you though, and I hope today wasn't a bad day for you guys. I hope it was amazing. Um, Please, please, please update me. Anything that you're proud of, let me know. Um, just be healthy, be happy, and I love you. Mwah.